brush is clean and I'm just going to try to get some of this white without getting some blue and I'm just going to come in I may have to put a I think what I'm going to have to do is put some gray in it so let's just get a little gray so we can make the white shine directly <laughs> So just coming in with some gray. And I can actually just put a little white over this to make this a lighter, lighter color gray. to go with another coat down here to make it end up with the um, red like we want it to. Okay, so we're going to skip. Yep, that's what we're going to have to do. We're going to come it down here with some more, another line to get our, that's okay, to end in red. So what I'm just going to do is just come on down a little bit further. Just gonna bring this white in. I'm just gonna go ahead and cover the whole thing in gray. Because I'm gonna have to do something with it for the red anyway. In here with some of this blue clean paint brush I'm using still using my number four um and I'm gonna have to put a little water with it because it's just so thick let's see if we can get this on here It's a little area and I have to work. <laughs> um, I'm trying to bring it down a little bit. It's a little area, so I really have to concentrate on it. I have a um, zero angle brush. So I'm just going to grab some white and then we're going to make some little dots on our um, hydrangea. flowers just some little circles and it doesn't matter where they go just they can be close together they can be far away from each other some can be bigger than others I just want the plant pretty full oh so you can see it actually kind of looks like a snowball bush right now don't it got my small bristle brush and we're gonna take our magenta and just get a little bit on the our paintbrush and then we're just gonna go crazy so wherever we see a, a stem we can just kind of um, you want smaller ones in the back and I just put some everywhere makes no rhyme or reason where they're at just as long as we have some flowers and then when you get a little closer, you can make them a little bigger. If you want some great big old ones? Just make some great big old ones. That's what I like to do. And I like for them to get over that water.
just making it um making it bright isn't it it's a bright happy painting that's what it is colors in here to us so let's go on over here and start doing some of it on this way I was gonna do the path lighter but I'm really not worried about that path cause I have some other things going on hasn't been used in a very long time. <laughs> purple I might as well do pink but I'm doing purple too so I'm gonna be happy with that <laughs> and then of course I'm gonna just do some little ones in here to make them look like there's just some little underneath That's why I said I'm not really worried about my path because my path is getting covered up so I was looking for the dark magenta but I'm really glad I got the lighter mag um, magenta so that um, I can this is dark enough I don't want it any darker and I can lighten it up. Yep, now so I'm going to grab some white and mix it with this magenta and make it a little lighter. Chopping off some of these little ones and make them have different tones. hard to get every flower but you want to try to get as many as you can because that gives you um, it doesn't make it look flat when you got several different um, colors in it to this main part here give it some lighter colors
So at this point I'm just going to grab a little white and start doing some little um, tapping some of that in. If I have too much paint on one side and I take the other corner and no, like that one I got too much so I decided to, to do it a little different but I take the other top corner and tap it in sometimes if I got too much on one side. saying it's just this is this is what's time consuming because it just takes a little time to to um, the more flowers you have the more <laughs> time it takes So I think, no, I thought I had them all, but I didn't have quite them all. very lightly doing it when I'm trying to just when I've got my brush so much paint on it I'm just barely trying to touch it so I don't have to tap as much okay so I think we have finished with our um I do want a little bit more pink right in here um with our flowers. Mm -hmm.